CSGO will be a frozen masterpiece forever. Uh oh. <clears throat> Alright, I wanted to make a video today because CS2 came out. That's stuff that you already knew though. Um, but basically what I wanted to say was CS2 is fine, it's great that it's out, and it's even better that CSGO is what it is right now. Because CSGO right now is frozen in a perfect spot. Valve can't f*** with it, Valve can't go do some and I'm about to show you right now exactly what to do. So here's what you're going to want to do. You're going to want to right click Counter-Strike 2. You're going to want to go to betas. You're going to go CSGO demo viewer. Why do you want the demo viewer? Just wait. Just wait. You have to be patient. <laughs> Let him cook, Chad. Well, once you downloaded the demo viewer that you uh, deleted CSGO to make space to install, you might realize that it's just CSGO. And then you might realize, wow, I deleted CSGO. <laughs> I feel you, homie. <laughs> I actually do. To install CSGO. That's my boy. Thank you, Valve. Um, but anyways, thank you, Valve, for even letting me play this. Uh, this is um, this is incredible. The fact that they're uh, letting me play this, and you might be wondering. I swear, I saw something says. These are his favorites, no? <laughs> Is that Femboy KZ? Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna say it. Uh, anyways, it, it'll... It, it, <laughs> anyways. You, have to, you have to do some work to get things to show up here, but uh, they, they do. Uh, and you can get from your your history too, which is good. Um, no one's on Utopia? Really? I wonder if it's down. Jesus. Empty servers. But yeah. Like there's um, a suck it surf. But uh <laughs> you'll always be able to play this game. You'll always be able to play this game. Um for forever, I guess. You'll always be able to play this game. Which is uh which is good because this game is a masterpiece and now it is a masterpiece that is frozen in time. Um Kinda good, which though. is even better. That is even better. Which it literally means like, a lot of people are saying that this is the end for CSGO, but for, for me, and I feel like for a lot of people, it's kind of the the end of, you know, it's the end of matchmaking, obviously, but it's the start of, like, a new era of CSGO, in a way. Because, like, what this is now is something that we've Chad, never let had them before. Both, uh, let them cook. Which is basically that there's no MM, the game sits in this state, and the players are left to find what they find and the game will advance as it does and i have this feeling the game will advance Shut the great that it has been doing for the past uh, <laughs> forever so we're going to be finding even more bugs in this game more crazy there's probably going to be like an increase in the modding community which is going to be awesome it's going to be like it's going to be just like it was but there's no matchmaking so it's like CS <laughs> Let's talking Japanese. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah.